In this video, we're going to be replacing the battery in this Casio. So the issue is that uh, when I turn this thing on, it has a little bit of juice to it, but if I cover up these solar panels, it dies pretty quick. And so I'm going to replace the battery and I hope that fixes it. To do this is actually really simple. You just take off the cover, flip it over. And then on the back right here, you've got six screws, but uh, you only really need to take out this one if you're lucky like me and you've got a little window right here. So it's just a standard Phillips screwdriver, which I really appreciate. I'm just stick this guy on there. I'm gonna undo that. There are a few threads on these guys, but uh, yeah, that guy just comes out just like that. Next, you can lift up on this guy just like that. It's got these little feet right under there that sit. And then I've got a flathead screwdriver. You can be careful when you do this. You don't wanna puncture the battery because these things can explode, but um, if you're careful enough, you'll be able to get it out. So I'm just gonna put a flathead right under there, pry up on this guy pops right out. Here's the old battery. The number is LR44. Um, so I bought, <laughs> I think 24 of these guys or 20 of them on Amazon for like $3 and 50 cents. So great deal. Um, but here's a new one. So just going to push this in, pop it down. And uh, I'm just going to, before I do this, I'm just going to power it back on. And now we can see that that battery's got enough juice in it to keep it alive. Even when it's dark, which is fantastic. So now I'm going to power this guy off and then we're going to put this cover back on and uh, I will say I think this other battery was a little bit exploded um, so glad I'm changing this. I'm going to put this guy on and switch the tip to the Phillips and there you go so just like that, we've got a working battery, the one that I used in high school. I love this calculator. So thanks all for watching and be well.